Hey guys, it's me. Hi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're talking about living in the end. No, we're not. Well, kind of. We're talking about how not to react to the 3D. That's what I was trying to get at. There is one simple, one simple way to not react to the 3D and I will tell you that in this video. Um, if you're interested in my coaching, I have one-on-one -on -one coaching. I also do replies in the month of December all the way to December 23rd. Um, anyone that gets coaching is automatically going to be put into like a little hat where I pick one of you to get nine free replies, a free 15-minute session, and 10 free affirmations. So if you want to get coaching, now is the time. Let's get our, our desires before Christmas. Let's do it. The number one way to not react to the 3D. This, listen with me, guys. This is a crazy one. Stop acknowledging it. The... The only reason that you are reacting or triggered or upset by the 3D is because you're acknowledging it and you're not supposed to be doing that. You're not supposed to acknowledge what's going on. You're not supposed to acknowledge the circumstances around you. You're not supposed to put your attention on that because even acknowledging the circumstances around you is affirming them. For example, um, if you look in the mirror and you're manifesting an appearance change and you see that you haven't really changed anything yet. You acknowledging that is now affirming that things have not changed. So you need to learn to stop acknowledging it. And when you stop acknowledging it, you will not be triggered because without acknowledgement, there is no reaction. That is literally it. It is extremely simple. And there's an extremely, cause I've been sitting here trying to figure out like, okay, I know how to not react to the 3D, but a lot of people ask me, how do I not react to the 3D? And the thing is, if you are not acknowledging it, you are not reacting. And if you are acknowledging it, you're not living in the end anyways. So there's no reason to even flip the reaction if you are already acknowledging it because you're already not living in the end. Both are not living in the end. Acknowledging and reacting are both not living in the end. So what you need to get yourself into doing is get into the habit of not checking, not acknowledging. When And sometimes, like, like we know, sometimes things are unavoidable. Maybe you have to do your hair in the morning or maybe you have to brush your teeth and you have to look in the mirror. Okay, hold yourself accountable then because reacting to the 3D, acknowledging the 3D is completely your choice it's completely your choice no one else's choice not mine not my neighbors not your best friends not your sps not your banks nothing no one else's choice but yours you have complete control to not check and learning that control learning that power learning that self-discipline the word that i always use is going to benefit you so much. Stop acknowledging it. Stop acknowledging it. Stop acknowledging it. If you are not acknowledging, there's no reaction, which causes no spiral, which then keeps you in the end goal. And that is all that you need to manifest. The only thing that's needed to manifest is living like you have it. If you had your desire, if your body looked exactly like you wanted it to, would you be going to the mirror and picking apart how it doesn't? No, you would not. So you are not living the end if you were doing that. If your SP was your partner, would you be complaining to your friends about how bad you want them to be your partner or thinking about how sad you are that you're single? No. So why are you acknowledging that? None of that is living in the end. The only true way to not react to the 3D because we're human, some things are going to trigger us sometimes. You have to stop acknowledging it. Stop giving it any attention. Stop. It does not matter. What is showing up around you does not matter until it's yours. So stop acknowledging it, stop giving it power, and put that power back in yourself. The more you acknowledge it, the longer you sit on the acknowledgement of the 3D and what you don't like, the more you are just affirming it's going to happen again. We affirm all the time, even when we don't mean to. So when you are sitting on those thoughts of what's actually happening in 3D, the unwanted circumstances, you are affirming that those unwanted circumstances are here and going to happen again, because what you focus on is going to continue to happen. So get into the habit of not acknowledging. It might be a little tricky at the start. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy peasy. Okay, we're good. It's gonna take a little bit, of, it's gonna take a second and it might be a little bit of a rocky road, but you will get there to the point where when you look in the mirror, you're not triggered because you know what's up here matters. And once you do that, your movement is gonna be like boom, 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 because manifesting is not difficult. Manifesting does not take long. Manifesting is literally just telling yourself you have it. And once you get into that and really persist in that, it's just going to be here. So that's the biggest tip I have for you for not reacting to the 3D. If you are reacting to the 3D, you are acknowledging it, which means you're not even living in the end. Okay. So learn to calm yourself. Learn to self-discipline yourself into making sure you're not looking, you're not acknowledging, and you're not giving attention to anything you don't want. Okay. Because say it with me. All of our thoughts are affirmations. All of our thoughts are affirmations. All of our thoughts are affirmations. And the persistent on ones will manifest whether you want them to or not. So learn to be persistent in the things that you do want instead of acknowledging the circumstances you're trying to get away from. 
But that is it for today's video. It was a very short, simple, easy, quick video for you guys. But it was a really important one because I don't think really people acknowledge that. Like, listen, if you're reacting to the 3D, it's because you're focusing on it. Sorry. That is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, watching this video has helped you manifest. Say it with me. Watching this video has helped me manifest. Watching this video has helped me manifest. And I'll see you guys soon.